Ripple, a San Francisco-based blockchain payment firm, has been shortlisted as a technology partner for the National Bank of Georgia's digital gel pilot project. The bank has shortlisted Ripple alongside eight other firms in its second gel CBDC project testing phase. The NFG, the NBG, plans to establish a limited access live pilot environment to evaluate the CBDC system's technological capabilities and potential applications through a series of use cases. Ripple CBDC advisor Anthony Welfare shared the development with the crypto community on the X platform. The National Bank of Ghana announced that nine firms have been identified as having the necessary technological prowess and experience to participate in the pilot initiative for the bank CBDC move. Ripple Labs was identified as one of these firms with the bank actively communicating with at least 30 countries to use its CBDC solution. The U.S. National Security Agency has announced the establishment of AI Security Center to manage the integration of AI capabilities within U.S. Defense and Intelligence Services. General Paul Nakasson, Director of the NSA and U.S. Cyber Command, emphasized the growing significance of AI in national security and emphasized the center's role in shaping AI technology's future in these sectors. The U.S. National Security Agency has established an AI security center to promote the secure adoption of new AI capabilities across the national security enterprise and defense industry. The center will be part of the NSA Cybersecurity Collaboration Center, aiming to prevent malicious foreign actors from obtaining U.S. AI innovations. The NSA study identified securing AI models from theft and sabotage as a key national security challenge, particularly as generative AI technologies emerge with transformative potential for both good and bad actors. According to some, doing is the best way to learn. A sneak preview of the 2023 Global Crypto Adoption Index by Chain Analysis reveals that Central and Southern Asia and Oceania is well ahead when it comes to blockchain technology and digital currency. This is the fourth year in a row that Chain Analysis has released this study. The gauge the grassroots to gauge the grassroots adoption of blockchain technology and digital currencies, it considers both on-chain and real-world data. The CSAO area is home to six of the top 10 nations, India, Nigeria, Vietnam, the US, Ukraine, the Philippines, Indonesia, Pakistan, Brazil and Thailand are listed in that order. The report shows that global adoption of digital currencies is down, but lower middle income countries have recovered the fastest. It examines data from 154 countries including on-chain and real-world data and uses sub-indexes to measure countries' usage of different services. The data is weighed by popula population size. The data is weighed by population size in purchasing power and is ranked on a scale of 0 to 1. Well, that's all in the bulletin. This is me, Vishakha Thakur, signing off. For more such updates related to Web3, log on to our website www.3worstv.io or scan the QR code.